everybody. You guys are not going to believe this. We were back up at Priest Lake and we we're gonna start busting ice and go for a canoe ride. We're gonna try and make it up to the upper lake. It's uh, the end of January and uh, first camping trip of the year. We're gonna do it in style. There we go, we got the old grooming or grumming out. And uh, you guys can see what we're going to have to bust through in order to get out to the open water. And it is a little bit windy, but the thoroughfare is over in that direction there. Anyway, we got a lot of work to do. It's about 10.30 in the morning. It was supposed to be sunny today, uh, but it's not. And it's snowing. Talk to you guys in a little bit. My buddy Tim and Chris. They're going to be joining us on this one. Yeah. Trace is up there chopping through the ice. Huh? <laughs> Don't worry, folks, it's not me. <laughs> yes. We thought it was going to be fun. <laughs> All right, so we're through the bad stuff. How you guys doing over there? Doing great. Right on. January. January. Awesome. And it's snowing. And I was asked earlier, what's wrong with me? Nothing. Take a look at the view. Yeah. Awesome. Got to get back to paddling. Yeah. You can't mess up even a little bit out here. You're stuck. <laughs> I know it. I mean, usually the water's three foot up the bank. So we're heading up the thoroughfare. Prepare for speed. Yeah. <laughs> January 20 or 30th. January 30th? Yes, January 30th. It is absolutely gorgeous out here. I had a little bit of trouble going through about, what, about 25 feet of ice. That was an experience. And and then a little bit of a sandbar because we're we're not used to the water being so low. So this is this is nice. So we'll get back to you in shortly. So here we are. Um, we're just passing Caribou Creek. Um, this is where it comes in. It's a lot more shallower through here. Um, than normal so it's you know navigating is a little harder but not too bad beautiful day for a canoe <laughs> trip <laughs> it's so nice out huh? you can't hear anything except for maybe one or two snowmobiles <laughs> 
Talk about peaceful. People out here, it's just fucking rad. I know, we have to enjoy it before <laughs> summer comes here and then I know. it's freaking Trace Lake, Washington. Oh crap. It's our sunny day. <laughs> there you go. Does not get any better than this in North Idaho. Trees is eating. Fire's going. <laughs> Tents should set up. All right, guys. There's our view. You can see it's it's froze over. We made it just to the first campground. We got some little bit of blue sky right there. A lot of fun. The snow is pretty deep. Once we busted trail, that was pretty easy. We're at the Geisinger campground. And we're here. We're gonna go out. Check some of the stuff out. This is usually underwater. This is the way we came in. And there's our tent. Our little tent there set up and ready to go. I'm not going to be cold tonight. And there's the... She froze all the way in there, so... I'm not going to bust through all that. I busted through enough of it today. <laughs> Winter camping. No Idaho. Folks, we survived the night. Yay! Actually, it's probably one of the best sleeps I've had outside in a long time. I didn't have to worry about bears or anything. It was, oh, it snowed a little bit. As you can see, our. There's our guests. This is our view for this morning. Again, wonderful. It looks like the ice creeped in a little bit farther. I don't know. Maybe it looks different with the snow. It stayed nice and freaking warm. I woke up sweating most of the time, so it might not have been a good thing, but I didn't get warm or cold, and I did not get wet at all, So, which was phenomenally awesome. But little tent did good. We just have a phenomenal view out there. So peaceful, so quiet. Just a nice, nice little getaway. I don't know, it doesn't feel as cold this morning as it did yesterday. But I don't know, maybe it's because I'm not as wet from chopping through ice. But we're supposed to get a bunch of snow today. So it'll probably be a very interesting trip out. Kind of like yesterday coming in. It was supposed to be sunny, which it did. It cleared off a little bit and we got some sun. But Tom's got our lantern going, so it's kind of a soft glow out here and the pretty snow covered trees and and just overall great night. Tom's down pumping water. into the Dromeda bag. Sun's starting to come out up over the mountain there. God, it's just absolutely gorgeous. I'm gonna get some breakfast going and uh, and pack up and head on out. It's just been a phenomenal 
great weekend. Looking forward to the trip out. It's gonna be cool. As Tom says, this is why we come out here. Might be a little tough sometimes getting here. A little wet, a little cold, but it's all worth it. We're heading back out. Heading back towards it. We're waiting for Tim and Christopher, which have we've had a fun woohoo! Phenomenal time. Goodbye campsite. You are awesome. There's Tom. We're heading on back out to thoroughfare. January 31st. Here we go. Oh, beautiful day. Wind just started picking up a little bit, but not too bad. And this is just phenomenal. Woohoo! Got it so nice and quiet this morning. Peaceful. I just absolutely love it. Sound of paddling water. Nobody's up here but us. Super, super nice. Great night. Good food, good company, all around fun freaking weekend. <laughs> Need to do this more often. Well, we're coming into the last part of the thoroughfare here, and uh, we just had two moose going across the river. We didn't get to catch them in the river, but they were up on the bank, and they've just come in from over this direction. And seriously hauled butt all the way down and they had just crossed the river down over here totally insane I can't believe how fast they move in this deep snow just and swam across the river too is <laughs> like, oh my god but um, we're gonna be coming out into the uh, Priest Lake here pretty quick and and uh, maybe I can get a little bit of footage out there on the on the river we're hoping it's not too windy and uh, hoping our little ice break that we broke through yesterday hasn't sealed itself back up too bad so we'll have an easy trip in